Hello, my friends, Sabrina Barella here with Your Freedom Track. So I took a few months off from this series that I call Big Talk with Sabrina, but we are back and we are picking right up where we, uh, where we left off. And so what I'm doing in this series is I am working with this little deck of cards called Big Talk. I'm in no way affiliated with the girl who created them, but I just love the movement and it's all about asking the big questions and getting to the heart of who we are as individuals rather than just making a bunch of small talk because that's boring and you don't get anywhere. You don't really uh, establish connection and relationships with people when you're just making small talk all the time. So I am going to answer a question in each video and what I would really love is if you would take a moment after the video to just comment below and let me know what your answer is to the very same question, okay? I love interaction. I love, I want to make this an interactive community. So today's question is, do you fit in or stand out and how so? For me, I would definitely say I stand out. I think I've always stood out and it's actually come with an awareness that I'm really tapping into more and more as I get older how much I actually stand out <laughs> and how, how different I am, you know? And as a little girl, I can always remember feeling like there was something different about me. And at different stages in my life, it, you know, I saw it a different way. I saw it from a different point of view, or I would say, oh, well, maybe it's because of this. Maybe it's because of that. But I just, you know, and I never knew where to place it exactly. It was just a feeling inside that I knew I was different. And I think it's interesting how from the time we're little, we are often in pretty much every area of life taught that in order to, you know, be safe, in order to be accepted, that you need to fit in with the group. You need to take on other people's beliefs. You need to take on, uh, you know, looking, feeling, talking, you know, whatever, like, like the community that you are around. And instinctually, you know, biologically, there's, ac there's actual, uh, you know, when it comes to human nature, there's scientific uh, reasoning behind that, uh, so to speak. And it all goes back to human instinct, human behavior that has to do, it's a tribal behavior, right? To, to fit in, to be like your, your group and their safety in numbers. So for those, those of us, <laughs> I say as myself, someone who stands out, for those of us who stand out, who do not fit in with the typical group that we're around, then it, it can leave us at times at feeling like an outsider. It can, in certain communities, it can mean that we, we do get ousted. You know, we, we, don't get, we don't get accepted and therefore we are out on our own, you know, until we find groups and communities of people that will accept us, um, standing out and all. So, so yeah, I mean, I just, I, I've never really felt like I fit in 100%. And the times where I tried to change myself in order to fit in, it never goes well. <laughs> it never goes well. Um, and I just ended up feeling like a fake. And I, I really, throughout my life, several times in my life, I've run into walls, so to speak, where I had to make a decision that, okay, am I going to be inauthentic? Am, am I going to pretend like I fit in? that I'm like everybody else in this community, or am I gonna stand up for myself and who I am and what I believe in and take a stand that's different than everybody else? And I've been in several groups where me standing out and being different meant that I was no longer accepted. Um, it happened in, in my own family, my extended family, because of religion. It happened, um, it's happened in various, um, you know, communities, circles of friends, even when I got to certain levels or I might've held different beliefs that they did. And we just got to this point where we, you know, we grew apart. I was standing out like a sore thumb in the group because I was just so different and it was time to move on. And I've actually learned to embrace that in, in a different way than I ever have before. And 
I think that's part of what has made me successful as an adult is, is being adaptable. Um, I do a lot of work with the Marine Corps, the improvise, adapt, overcome. I've learned that from my guides, from all my friends, and I really implement that in life. And I think the quicker you can really take that in and embody it in all areas of life, you're going to grow and succeed like nothing else. So, yeah, if I had to choose either one, I would say stand out every time. Don't be what I call a sheeple. Um, listen to your heart. You know, listen to your heart. Listen to what your gut. Listen to what's going on inside. You should always be standing out from, <laughs> from other people. Who wants to be the same as everyone else? That's no fun at all. Anyways, that's my answer to the question. If you would please comment below, let me know for you. Do you fit in or do you stand out? My name is Sabrina Varela. I'm with Your Freedom Track. You can connect with me at www.yourfreedomtrack.com. Send me comments, send me questions for another video series, or uh, just connect with me and let me know what you have going on in your life and how I can help you. Okay, so in the meantime, I hope you have a wonderful day, wonderful evening, and I will see you in the next video.